Lily and Nana Group from DOB Ecology are visiting Zambia's Simulaha Community Conservancy where they learn more about how conservation-friendly farming techniques are helping the local farmers in the area. So what are we seeing here? We are in conservation agriculture area where we have minimum uh, tillage of land or we leave a lot of uh, cover crops uh, residues in the field. You know? So these are um, uh, are the fields and you have seen that they harvest what they have harvested but they have left the field covered with, uh, with, uh, with the crop residue to reduce the loss of moisture but also it rots and it goes back to cause some improvements in soil in terms of manure, in terms of water holding capacity and the like. So this is a typical conservation uh, principle that they are applying here. Who is the owner of this field? Is it yours this or it's for your neighbor? Field. Tell us what you are doing here then. What I'm doing here is, yeah, I'm trying to, uh, to make holes. Okay. You want yeah. to plant yes. something? Maize. I'm okay. planting maize. Okay. All right. Okay. When I'm making sands, uh -huh. on what I'll get from that no, small uh -huh. field. Calculating yes. how much you make. Uh -huh. Then I just calculate here the number of, the number of yeah. in the length and in the width. Then now, why don't you remove this? No, 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 no. Yes. This is uh, these things helps a lot, yeah. Okay. Uh, one, uh, when they rot from there, it's they, manure. Oh, when they okay. Two, they prevent uh, weeds. Okay. Good. I get so, it. I yeah. get it. Peace Parks Foundation aims to support communities by helping to develop farming techniques that will provide year-long food security and balanced nutrition. This is done by training local farmers in conservation agriculture installing human piled treadle pumps to help irrigate crops, as well as digging wells which provides a community with a water supply that can sustain them long into the dry season.